flip through Daniel Nicoletta's LGBT San Francisco so that I could remember what it was all for, so I could see my ancestors, so I could feel pride. The first images are of Harvey Milk and his legacy. I'm struck by the image of the white night riots and the image of graffiti the next day. Gay riots now. The white night riots were the gay community's response to the voluntary manslaughter sentence for Dan White after he shot and killed both Harvey Milk and Mayor George Moscone. It started as a peaceful protest, but soon became violent, leading to hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of damage to City Hall and the surrounding area. The police made a retaliatory raid on a gay bar in the Castro, leading to many patrons being beaten by police in riot gear. All my freedoms today are built on the riots of my queer ancestors, many of them black and brown, and their fight. Queers are resilient folks who continued to create, express, and love despite decades of oppression. Seeing these photos connects me to my community. It reminds me of what I have and the fight others were willing to fight so I could have it. As a white queer man, it is my legacy and responsibility to show up for all black, indigenous, and people of color, particularly our trans brothers and sisters. I have not always showed up as I should, but I cannot let that shame stop me from doing what is right now. I am showing up, shutting up, listening, and no doubt will fuck up again. But it is all worth it, because my very life is a testament to the other side of the fight, and it's time to repay the gift I was given.